Danny and the Dinosaur, Mind Their Manners by Sid Hoth. One day, Danny and the Dinosaur were walking to the museum when they saw a brand new sign. What does that mean? asked the dinosaur. A king is a very important person, said Danny, and he's coming here. Wow, I never met royalty, said the dinosaur. What are kings like? Kings are very fancy, said Danny. So if we want to meet a king, we have to be on our best behavior. You mean say please and thank you, asked the dinosaur. Even more than that, said Danny. Maybe our manners need work. Tell me what to do, said the dinosaur. I can't wait to meet a king. Danny and the dinosaur bowed to each other. The dinosaur's bow needed a little help. Danny and the dinosaur tried taking turns using the drinking fountain. Danny and the dinosaur worked up standing up nice and straight. And the dinosaur stood up even straighter. The two pals washed their hands before eating. At lunch, Danny and the dinosaur tried eating with their mouths closed. It was a little tricky at first, but they managed. It's polite to compliment the cook after a meal, said the hot dog seller. That was delicious said Danny and the dinosaur together. What do you call a king anyway, the dinosaur asked Danny. Mr. King, your kingness? Let's ask the museum director, Danny said. You call him your majesty, said the museum director. Why do you ask? We saw that a king is coming. And we want to be polite when we meet him, said Danny. The director smiled. But this king isn't alive. It's King Tut's mummy. He died 3,000 years ago. Danny slumped. The dinosaur looked sad. All that hard work for nothing? Then Danny looked up. Wait a minute, he said. A mummy? That's cool. That's right, said the director. And you deserve a reward for working so hard to be polite. And when King Tut arrived, guess who got to be first in line? <laughs>